You are watching Phone Arena's video review of Nokia 5610 Express Music. The phone from this series, as you may expect judging by the name, targets the music fan audience. The slider 5610 falls in the middle class with a quite youthful and sporty appearance combined with a good player and an FM radio. On the front side we have a 2.2 inch QVGA 240x320 TFT display with 16.7 million colors. It is covered by a scratch proof glass which is a fingerprint magnet. It has a very good contrast and the picture is beautiful with well saturated and lively colors. We were pleasantly surprised by its performance in direct sunlight. Everything was visible but as if slightly faded. Below we have the soft and the navigation buttons. The music slider is the innovation here. You can easily push it left or right and it will automatically come back to its position in the middle. It is flanked by the system LEDs. Sliding it once to the right, for example, will take you to the radio screen or the music player if you repeat the action. Sliding it once more will bring you to that home screen and not back to where you were before. The rest of the buttons are standard for almost every phone. They are all located on a glossy smooth surface and have no relief except the D-pad. They are not hard to push and you can easily feel pressing them. The sliding mechanism is quite stable and it allows a smooth opening. This action reveals the shiny black keyboard with a white backlight. The only remark we would like to make is that the top row is very close to the edge which is annoying. The bottom side houses only a strap hole since the charging micro USB and 2.5mm jack connectors are located on the top one accompanied by the battery lit release key. Removing the lid is a hard task and this kind of inconvenient because of the micro SD card slot is located underneath. On the right side we have the volume control and the camera dedicated button. The first one is not easily felt and is hard to press because it doesn't have a well expressed relief but the other one is considerably easy to use. Nokia 5610 Express Music uses the Series 40 interface and here we have the latest 5th edition. You have the option to enable the active standby to appear on the home screen which has shortcuts and organizer formation. If you prefer the simpler view you will only see the options of the functional keys. The main menu is visualized as a 3 by 3 grid with labels by default but you can also choose list, grid or tabs. The phone book and the organizer are the standard for the Series 40 and there is nothing to surprise us here. In the music player menu you can see all your tracks, playlists to sort by artist, album, genre or to look through the videos present. Naturally there is an option for a background play which lets you use the rest of the phone functions at the same time. While listening to a track you can see its number and album cover if such is available. FM also has a user friendly interface. You can input a specific frequency, auto search for the next or all available. The sound quality produced by the loudspeaker is good for a phone. Using the headphones from the package enhances the music experience to a great extent, but you get better results if you invest in a quality set. 5610's camera is 3.2 megapixel without a focus and a double LED flash. The pictures are average and you'd rather use them for recording a funny moment or the image of a loved one, but don't expect professional quality. You can also shoot videos with a VGA resolution. During a talk, the sound you hear will be accompanied by a constant crackling noise. At the other end of the line there will be complaints about the weak and muffled sound. The battery is long lasting and that would satisfy even the users with the highest requirements. If you are looking for a music slider, at an affordable price, Nokia 5610 Express Music is just for you. It will offer you a fresh design, good sound quality when listening to your favorite tunes and above average during a talk. On top of that, you get a long-lasting battery. However, if you are still hesitating, take a look at the Sony Ericsson V910. Thanks for watching. Please visit phonearena.com for our full text review with many pictures and a 360 degrees view.